Hey guys, Moose here with another episode of RimWorld. We recently started a new colony. We have another visitor. We want to trade. We suck at social. I'm going to pass for now. Thanks, but no thanks. So we're moving along pretty nicely. We got a researcher. That was uh, that seems like a pretty valuable thing to start with. The more I look into it, it's about a third of the way through leveling up to twelve, which is good. He's a strong expert right now. I'd love for him to be like a prodigy. That would make my life even better. We could just get all the things. Never have to worry about researching shit again. The problem is, I think he's our miner too. And we're going to need that at some point. What's this? Silver? Plasteel. Even better. Low food, low medicine. All right. So let's worry about furniture. No, nope. structure. Um, wall, right? Let's go up by 11. Do that, but then do this too. There we go. All right. Go two in from the wall, and then two in from the wall. And in there, we're going to want to have floors. Get our stockpiles going early. Okay, so you can't build floor under walls. All right, that's good to know. Okay. People aren't really doing much. Um, I think the problem is we kind of need Andy for construction and he's focusing on research, which is good, but also not great. Uh, how are you doing? About halfway there. Cool. We want to get our stockpiles going. Uh, we're just going to go with Redwall again. It's not great, but I, I don't know. That's what I can think of right now. I need to go back and read more books. Just haven't had time between recording and all this shit. Work. All the stuff that goes wrong with that. Oh, good. Andy's working again. Cut down those trees, buddy. You know, maybe we need more wood. What if we say... Quarters. Chop wood. Chop that wood. Can Doc do that? Yes, Doc can do that. Okay, perfect. I think he was idling because he can't do construction, so it's good that he's gathering wood. It's allowing us to get through with the stockpile rooms more quickly. So I think we're going to have a couple different stockpile rooms. I'm not sure how we want to handle it, but we also need to worry about power. I don't know how we're going to do that. How should I do that? Add animal. Okay, you're going to be hunted. You're going for she. Yeah, she, that's not going to work out for you. Kick its ass. Andy also kick its ass. Get in there, dude. She is like real hurt. No, oh, not that hurt. Okay, now I kind of hurt. Good. Uh, okay. Undraft, undraft. Go. Combat's over. She's, like, looks really hurt. Oh, she got shot. Dude, Andy, you shot her. What the hell? Alright, well, whatever. That's life, I suppose. Sucks to be she. What is your, what are you? You're the janitor. What was your history, though? Don't recall. You're the jogger, though. You're the last person we got, so what if they look... Okay, that's not it. That's not it either. Eh, I have no idea. Whatever. 
she is like someone. Do you have a relationship with anyone? Okay. All right. For a second there, I thought lover was like a tab, so he was lovers with both of these two, but it does not appear to be the case. That would have been amusing. All right. Treat the colonists. That's fine. While we're doing this, we may want to say production butcher table right there and electric stove, I guess down here. That should be fine for now. We'll have another crafting area down below. Good. Poor result. But hey, you treated the place where you shot her, you fucking savage. You shot your lover in the foot. In the foot. It's kind of a shitty thing to do. You're not very good at healing either. Well, what are you going to do? That's life, I suppose. You already cut down all the trees, Doc? What the hell? Cut down some more trees. Cut down, like, all of the trees. We need more wood. Alright, speed up. There we go. So she is healing, that's okay. Okay, a panther just murdered the shit out of a boar. It's been messed up a couple times, that's kind of cool. Should take that boar. It ate its legs and its neck, but that's kind of it. I don't think that's how panthers work. Or I don't think that's how hunting works in general. Oh well, everyone's sleeping. She might not be sleeping, but uh, resting at the very least. That's fine. You know, monkeys cause pro. Oh, good, lovely. You're fully healed. You don't even have an old gunshot wound. That is fantastic. Speedy recovery. Some luck for once. I don't. I mean, I don't know if that's luck. I mean, it's just you know the wounds weren't that bad anyway. So, you know. what are you doing, Andy? Going for a walk, okay. Alright, get to work. Doc, you get a ton of shit to cut down, so let's get that done. We need the wood. Pretty badly, too. Marriage is on. Andy has ex Oh, she proposed. All the colonists, consider placing a marriage spot if you want control where the ceremony... I don't really care. Doing it anywhere is acceptable. Just don't waste too much time on it. You gotta work. Working is much more important than love. Just keep that in mind. Okay. Getting a good amount of wood. That's nice. Uh, we're low on food, so I'm gonna order some more harvesting. Which there does not appear to be much ready to harvest at this moment. Eh, let's get him out. That's fine. Wanderer join. Okay, we got Zeppi. Villager named Zeppi has arrived and is joining the colony. He's a charity worker. You look strange. You're naked. You have an armored vest, a shiv, and nothing else. You're not capable of violence. Okay, you're an apocalypse survivor. And you're a charity worker. So you're good at social, which is like one of the major things we did not have. So that's actually great. Uh, you're also heat tolerant, which is good. But you're kind of shit at everything else. So... Aha, guess what? You're going to be cutting down trees and building shit. I hope you're willing to get used to it, because that's all you're going to do. All right, there we go. Okay, so time to start designating stockpile zone, stockpile. We're not gonna differentiate them yet, but one will eventually be for food. It's just we don't have any cooling yet, so there's no point. 
So we're going to want Andy to do research soon, but more importantly, we need to get power. Covering the bedrooms is going to be big too. Good, so just about okay. Most things are now indoor. Some over here they need to cover. There we go. And then the hallway. I guess because it's not sealed in at all, they're not covering it. It's fine. Not overly concerned by that. Okay. They're moving stuff into the stockpiles. That's good. We want that. That's definitely something we want to have. I hope we can do, like, different kinds of power later. I'm assuming that requires research, which Andy will get to work on real soon. We have 249 berries, which is good. I didn't even know that showed up here, honestly. Okay. So I think bedrooms will continue in this direction. We might have some kind of crafting up here. We might even move this this stockpile over to the side and then have this be a crafting room at some point. Not totally sold on that yet. Might just do it off in this direction. I don't know if noise pollution is an issue in this game. It's a factor to consider in Dwarf Fortress, but this is kind of a, like I said many times, Dwarf Fortress light. So it may not be a factor here. Just not really sure if it is or not. So, either way, electricity is the next thing, I think. So, I think solar power is the way to go. For now, at least. So, I don't really like sealing off this direction, kind of, but I think it's sort of necessary. So, just put them here. And then what we'll do is structure like this and have doors here here we have a raid one guy not a big deal head right over here he coming yeah he's coming okay should have a clear shot all right, well, he should have been messed up on the way in. Yep, and he was. Shot off his toe, that's rude. Okay. Murder him. Strip him. And you're off duty. Have fun. We are going to put the grave way the hell over here, I think. Miscellaneous. Great. Put it right there. I don't really want to deal with uh, capturing people just yet. Soon, sure, but not yet. Anyway. Uh, floors. Wood floor right there. want to do it here, too. Space already occupied. Alright, whatever. And then... Chop wood. Just get some more wood. Could always use more wood, right? We already bury him? Yeah, we already buried him. Fantastic. Research is almost done. It's not taking too long. It's actually going over quite well. Right, enemy, yeah, blah, blah, blah. Alright, so are you a night owl or what? No, you don't appear to be. Yeah, you're fine, you're fine. Oh, I see, they want a double bed. Okay. Well, what if I say... Move it here? And then what we're going to do instead is do furniture, double bed. We're actually going to say deconstruct, deconstruct, cancel, cancel, 
Furniture, double bed. There you go. We'll put a bed here. It just won't. I should have just said, oh, it's no longer owned by you. Instead of getting rid of that one. That was a little bit silly, but whatever. It's fine. It's not going to cause a problem, really. Now you're going to let us do the floors, right? Yeah, okay. There we go. Okay. So we're going to want to do batteries in here. That should be enough for now. And we're also going to want to do... What? What happened? Oh, I fucked up the placement of these. That's fine. Power soldier. What? 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 Okay, research. Good. Uh, gun turrets, please. Thank you. Architect. Power. Power, power, power. There we go. That's what I wanted to do. Okay, so we're going to need to mine. Don't think we have enough steel. We have a good number of components. So, of course, that's what I found first. Is this steel? Yeah, okay, compacted steel. Okay, so I can't designate more than that right now. There's a trader here, but I don't care that much. Some... Okay. Deconstruct that, please. I'll take some more steel. Solar flare. That's fine. I don't have any electrical devices to be shut down anyway. Does not concern me in the least. So how you doing on research, buddy? Yeah, I'm getting there. Oh, you're losing progress as you sleep. That's very interesting. So I guess you have to do something consistently or you will get worse at it. So hunting is good because it'll increase the shooting of our hunter. I mean, consistently. Zeppi, why don't you go trade with this jerk? Really? You're selling slaves. Really? Can I? Do I have any money? I don't know if I have money. You'd think it'd show up like over here or something. I guess silver is money, maybe? So I could almost... I could actually buy... Kim the Escapee, which is an 83-year-old male. Baseline human, mostly unmodified by gene modification, gene engineering, and mostly unchanged by evolutionary pressures on non-Earth planets. Okay. Interesting. I will pass on the slaves for now. I'm not necessarily opposed to owning slaves in this game. What's going on? Dude, Baxter, come on, you're getting hurt. I mean, cool, you killed a boar, but those slaughter animals, which are animals do forever. Good, good, good. Hmm. Let's make this one food items only. No human-like, no mechanoid. Okay. So then we're gonna we're gonna cool this one, but we're uh, like we can't finish these. I don't know why. Someone needs to work on those. It's probably Andy that has to do it. So you know what? I'm gonna disallow research for now, so that you get to work on other shit. Well, no, you know what? We have other people. Everyone else can do construction. What the hell? Except for Doc, but I don't want Doc to do construction. Or I don't care. If you know what? Why don't I care? Fuck it. Do it. 
I mean, that's what these take, right? Never took anything special before. Let's disallow food here. And also disallow animal cor- okay, animal corpses are already disallowed. Body parts. Okay, whatever. Alright, so we have our food stockpile. Shit's gonna go bad, but it's better than nothing, I suppose. Uh, set owner. Andy and she. There we go. See, you get to sleep together. Isn't that wonderful? Alright, well... That's going to have to do it for this episode. Thank you very much for watching. We'll try and figure out what's wrong with the solar generators in the future. But uh, thanks for watching this episode. I hope you enjoyed it, and I hope you join me with the next one. Take care.